times, got for arm tying. Mm. Sick, sick, sick eyes from the nose pressure. Freshly slip, zip ties on the protesters. Has the six wives in the fry of a mole. Less the meta, meta caviar. What's going on, guys? It's Shadows. Welcome back to another Black Ops 3 video. Today is a new series, gonna be weekly on my channel. It's gonna be the top 5 slash top 10 series. I know a lot of people do this already, but mine's is gonna be a little bit unique, and the topics are gonna be chosen by you guys, and I'm gonna try to um, use my opinions. But this first topic, of course, will be mine. Um, the first two topics will be mine, so I'm gonna do this series every single Monday. Um, and uh, um, it's gonna be a weekly series. And like next week will be the top five worst maps in Call of Duty Black Ops 3. So tell me, guys, what is the worst maps you guys think in Black Ops 3? And uh, yeah, guys, uh, and, uh, let's get right into this video. Um, I'm gonna and we're gonna be doing the top ten, top five best maps in Black Ops 3. Uh, I'm gonna be giving a honorable mention, and that honorable mention is going to go to Redwood. I know. Um, it could have been in the top 10, but the thing is, I really don't like Redwood for uh, hard point. I like Redwood for search only, and that's why it's not. It's in the honorable mention. It's not in the top five, but I still like Redwood for search and destroy especially. N uh, number five, coming at number five is Breach. Um, you guys may disagree on me, but I love this map for search, domination, and hard point kill confirmed. I don't know. I love this map. There's a lot of wall run spots, but the thing is... If you go in the middle, it's basically that, like, I like it because, like, not everybody has to go in the middle. Because usually when you go in the middle, um, people die. And this is basically like a assault rifle map. Uh, I like to uh, use my, um, even a Razorback would work, but I like to use my HVK, and especially on this map or the Man of War. This is just a really good map. And there's a lot of wall running spots, a secret wall running spots, but they're pretty hard to do because you can die. But... I don't know. I just love how this map is. It's just really good map. Um, there's a one secret little wall run spot here where you can try to, and there's another wall run spot where you can try to flank the enemy from the other side. So, coming at number four spot is of course Fringe. Um, I don't know. To me, this map reminds me of so many old old maps from the previous Call of Duty, like Black Ops 2 and MW2. I don't know. This map is really good. And it kind of plays like breach because in the middle, usually there's uh, two forming points, one window and the other window. And if you kind of go in the middle, there's a lot of chances that you will die. And if you don't know what those chances are, you could die in a lot of these chances because uh, they're, they're probably going to be going with the sniper, the assault rifles, or even the LMGs. Now, this map can be good for assault rifles a lot and maybe SMGs if you're rushing. But I don't know, uh, I'd probably use the assault rifles on this one. Coming at number three is Hunted. If you did not know, Hunted is a pretty beast map in Black Ops 3. Like, this is a beta map. This map, I would usually run SMGs or assault rifles. I love how this map is. There's underwater and everything, and uh, it's so good. And I think the next two maps are, of course, going to be in the beta. They're also beta maps, but... I don't know, man. The beta maps were beast. Um, this map's good for basically any game mode, I think. Um, coming in, the number two spot is going to be, of course, Stronghold. This map is another beta map. It's a beast beta map. Like, I love this map from the beta. Um, it's so good for domination, kill confirmed hard point and it's a like it's actually a competitive map this is a competitive map i love to play search especially search and destroy on this map and domination stronghold is one of my favorite maps i don't know i used to not like this map during the beta but now i love it coming in the number one spot is combine this map is beast and if you don't know why i love this map it's because of this it's such a small map uh it's really it's a small map which i love i just don't know i love small maps um and you guys are probably like where's nuketown or i'm not gonna be adding no dlc these are default maps no dlc of course if there was dlc nuketown would probably be first um if this was dlc it'd be nuketown first but it's not dlc it's default maps only this map's so small i love to play on any game mode and i say any game mode um, it's really fun to play, especially for sniping. 
if you're trying to do a 1v1 sniping, it's really fun to play this map. I think this is one of the best maps in Call of Duty Black Ops. If you guys enjoyed, please leave a like, subscribe to become a shadow, and